Hey Libras, I'm here to do your reading. All right, Libra, let's see what's going on with your energy. Let's light some sage. All right. Remember, Libra, these are not personal readings. These are energy readings, meaning I can only pick up on the strongest energy, whether that energy is really, really good or really, really bad. Every Libra is not on the same vibration, you guys, cross watchers. You can switch the energies if you like, all right? Um, check your Venus sign for your love language, all right? Always check your Venus sign um, to see what's going on in your love life, just in case love doesn't come up in this reading, all right? Libra, let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on for Libra. I think I got some more say somewhere. Let's see what's going on for your energy, Libra. Let's get into your breaking news. Let's see what's going on with your breaking news. All right, Libra. Breaking news for Libra. Okay, Okay, so this is my Rihanna. I don't want to be a murderer. I don't want, I don't want to be a murderer. A murderer? Okay, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, murder was the case that they gave me. All right? So, yeah, I don't want to be a murderer. Okay, so... Maybe someone is in love with you and you're breaking their heart or you're not in love with this person and this person is really in love with you, okay? Um, yeah, or straight get to business, okay? Straight straight get busy on somebody, all right, here? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I know the feeling, all right? Let's see what's going on with your energy, Libra. Oh, let's see the person you're dealing with. I made some new little um, yeses and no's here. And I um, did personals. Like um, the person you're dealing with, um, their personality, their moon sign, or however you deal with this person, all right? The person you're dealing with or the situation you're dealing with. Let's see. Got me a whole new little, little box here. Oh, I should have got something better to put this thing in. All right. Let's see who you're dealing with here. Oh, you could be dealing with a Virgo or a Gemini. Um, I have Chiron here, okay? That is Virgo's energy and Mercury. So, uh, you could be dealing with a Virgo or a Gemini here. Um, whew. You don't want to be a murderer. You probably don't want to um, break this person's heart, okay? Um, yeah, go listen to uh, Rihanna, all right? So, yeah. Um, this person um, might sometimes feel kind of nervous with Chiron here. Okay, probably like a um, perfectionist. This person might always feel like something is like fundamentally um, wrong with them, okay? They might feel like a piece of them was made wrong, okay? This person is very um, perfection, um, like to be perfectionist. Let's see if it's a good thing or a bad thing. Oh, it's a bad thing. Okay, so um, 
might be a little single minded uh, about a situation. This person has a very critical eye, all right? This person could be obsessed with details um, to the point of insanity, all right? This person likes to spot flaws. And this person don't trust emotions, all right? Um, this is the bad side of Chiron. So this could be in their um, sun, moon, or rising, okay? If you're dealing with Mercury, you're dealing with a Gemini. Some of you guys could be dealing with a, either a Virgo or a Gemini, okay? So um, Mercury is kind of like... Um, very conning, all right? Um, this is the, you give them a little information. Um, they're like, I call them the news reporter, Mercury. Um, they transfers information. Um, they use their mind a lot, very intellectual, um, knows how to communicate. Mercury is the charmer, okay? can get anybody to do anything, okay, in a charming way, okay, if you're dealing with the Gemini, okay, on a bad side, okay, so this person always is looking for improvement, trying to be practical, all right, in a good way, okay, this person can be a loyal friend, but secretly insecure, about everything all right all right so let's see what the energy is looking like oh yeah i don't want to be a murderer oh my goodness not for you okay so you reject someone here, the number 666, okay? Rejection is God's protection. So, yeah, this is someone that you rejected. Wow, the thinker, okay? Okay, the thinker card is an air sign, so you could be dealing with the Gemini here, okay? The number 44 or an Aquarius. A Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, all right? So someone here that you rejected is, um, they're strategizing, being um, analytical and logical, very strategic in their ways, all right? So someone here is um, strategizing a plan, okay? No just desire. Okay, so... So this person is in their mind a lot about a rejection, okay? So I don't want to be a murderer. So yeah, you reject someone here um, and they're thinking about it. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to use a different deck. Let's see what's going on, Libra. This is for my number one. Let's see what's going on, Libra. What is going on in Libra's energy, please? Archangel Michael Ancestors. All right, you have the Ten of Cups. Okay, so you probably rejected someone, but you do um, value the relationship with this person. So this is contentment, a happy heart, and perfection. You do value the relationship, okay? Wow, what happened? Okay. The five of cups. So you lost something in the relationship that made you frustrated with this person. Oh, wow. So, I have here... Three. 
the seven of cups in the reverse here. So you have a lot of determination, desires for a project coming. Okay, so you have a lot of de um, desire here for a project that's coming up, okay? And you also have the Knight of Wands in the reverse. So there is a um, some type of bad interruption. And there's a lot of division going on here, okay? between you and this person um, because of a rejection. You had a lot of determination, okay? Something here, maybe in a family situation, something that had a lot of value that may... <coughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me, Libra. I'm talking too fast. That made you frustrated, okay? Okay, let's see what's going on here. Yeah, this could have been a marriage. Um, either a marriage or a work situation. Almost to your peace and happiness. Uh, happiness, sorry. Um harmony here okay you could have been dealing with an Aries okay if this this looks like a family situation a love situation here and someone here is moving on okay mm, and the tower okay so Someone is not trustworthy, either in a marriage or a business situation. All right? Someone feel like you wasn't trustworthy. What the hell? A third-party situation here. Okay, so... So this is like the consolation of any matter, okay? Victory, um, plenty, and perfection, all right? This is weird. A new beginning, okay? Someone here... Someone here is dreading um, starting over. Someone could have went to jail. But for sure, the Eight of Cups here. Leaving a lot of secrets and illusions behind. Someone could have moved away from a marriage or a business situation. A family situation. Take the energies how you want, okay? Cross watchers. Um, okay, somebody feel like, you might feel like you have a better fit, okay? With an earth sign, uh, with the king of pentacles, you could be dealing with a Capricorn, whatever it is, um... Someone here is moving on. Someone feels like... Let me clarify this again. The Ten of Cups. Clarify this energy for me for Libra. Archangel Michael, ancestors, please come through. For Libra. Wow, what the hell? The Five of Pentacles. Okay, somebody could have left you out in the cold. And, um... A family situation. Or a work situation. The Six of Swords. With the Five of Cups. Releasing baggage, 
okay frustrated you release baggage somebody here um, could have rejected you or some here um, you could have been dealing with the Aries uh, for sure a Pisces cancer or a Scorpio here okay <coughs> so you're trying to make something happen okay um, for a new beginning here you have a lot of de desire um, and determination for um, a project that is coming, okay? But whatever desire that you have after moving on and being frustrated in a situation, it looked like you rejected something, you're moving on. And you have a big project with the magician card here to make something happen, okay? Um, so, your new beginning will be, uh, there's some type of um, bad interruption and division here, okay? Amongst a third party situation. So you don't want to be a murderer. You don't want to hurt nobody's feelings in a situation. You could be dealing with somebody that is a, um, that drinks too much. And with Chiron, you might be dealing with a um, narcissistic person. Or you're probably in love with a narcissistic person. Um, there's no telling. In a love situation... Uh, you could have been dealing with someone that was married, all right? You could have been dealing with someone that was already married, okay? And I don't know if you think, like, um, I can be with this person or we can get married in a situation. The chariot. Yeah, this person is sitting here thinking, all right? Um, this could have been a, um, a business situation or you're, you're in love with someone that you work with, okay? Um, you could be missing business with pleasure. Um, Ten of Cups with the Ten of Cups. Okay, whatever this is, I don't think it has anything to do with love. I don't see no kings on the board. I don't see no queens on the board. Um, this could have been uh, in love with someone you work with or someone that is already married, all right? But I don't think you really have to worry because I think you're telling someone the truth, okay? Um, I see the number 24 here, okay? Something could be happening on the 24th, okay? This month, um, next month, okay? I see here someone could stay in Washington, D.C., all right? Or someone here is getting a surgery, all right? Yeah, somebody here is moving to be in a, independent, uh, all of these swords. Somebody could be getting a surgery. Um, somebody is moving away from a, a business situation or a marriage situation. But I think you feel frustrated. You might be in love with someone you work with or someone you work with might be in love with you and you rejected this person. They're really thinking they're moving on, okay? Or you probably had to move on or move away here out of a frustrating relationship, all right? This person is moving forward to be um, dependent, to be very independent here with the Nine of Pentacles. 
the chariot. Someone they feel like you wasn't trustworthy. Someone here is being very successful. Someone could be moving away from a business here. Or a business situation. A third party situation for sure. Okay. Someone feel like they had to defend themselves here in a third party situation. All right. Heavy Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um... Virgo Gemini, all right? I don't know. Yeah, I have the Three of Pentacles with a new beginning. So, yeah, um, your skills and your talent, all right? Let's see what this person wants to say to you, Libra. Oh... Not showing true feelings, hiding, pretending, um, gaslighting. Someone feels like, somebody probably feel like you're wearing a mask here or vice versa. Someone is wearing a mask in this relationship. This person is interested. They want a conversation Conversate more, awaiting a message to arrive, a text, a call, um, an email. Somebody is waiting by their phone, all right? Somebody that you rejected or whatever this is here. Somebody really likes you and... I think you're trying to let someone off easy. This person really frustrates you, I believe, okay? Mm. But if you're going towards a, a earth sign, I don't think that's going to work either. Um, somebody will come right on time. So you're healing here, healing from a broken heart. So you're having freedom from toxic um, relationships and addictions. All right. So, yeah, you could be dealing with someone that likes to drink a lot. You're probably um, in love with a narcissistic person. Okay. Mm, 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 mm. So, yeah, you might be um, starting a new beginning somewhere else. Be careful if you're dealing with an earth sign, all right? Um, this person is going to come right on time, okay? But take your time with the relationship, okay? Let's get you out a spiritual message. Let's see what I can pull out first here. Yeah, um, accelerated motion, the number eight here. So, yeah, you're moving at the speed of light, okay? Try to slow. Oh, sorry, Libra. <clears throat> Try to slow down a little bit, okay? Let's see what else. Yeah, and work on your crown chakra, the number seven. All right, the color purple or the color wh white. So, a lot of understanding, um, your thoughts. So, you would do well with um, purple crystals um, or clear um, crystals. Clear quartz or diamond. All right. Thank you so much, Libras. Bye, Libras.